Osio Robot Car V2.1 Kit Lesson 6 Use Wi-Fi to Control an IoT Robot Car In this lesson, we will connect robot car to Wi-Fi and use an app to control the car through Internet. This is a typical Internet of Things IoT application. Step 1 Hardware Installation You must complete and test Lesson 5 before you continue on with this lesson. If you don't install Tracking Sensor Module, please complete an installation in Lesson 4. Our OSIO UART Wi-Fi Shield V1.3 are connected via LE UART TX slash RX ports to D4, D5 with jumper caps by default. If you find the BLE UART TX slash RX ports are connected, please remove these jumper caps and change to connect ESP UART ETX to D4 and ERX to D5. Now the IoT robot car is completed. Step 2, Install App. The app for this lesson is compatible with Android and iOS device. You can go to Google Play or Apple App Store to search OSIO Wi-Fi UDP Robot app, and you will see an orange icon. Please download and install this app. Click to click this app, you will see the interface in Android and iOS device as these. Step 3, Testing. OSIO V2 Robot Car can work in two Wi-Fi modes, STA mode and AP mode. The Arduino sketches for these two modes are different. Let's explain these two modes one by one. Mode A. STA mode. Download Wi-Fi ESP master library from www.osio.com slash driver slash Wi-Fi ESP master zip. Download simple code from lesson 6 and then unzip this file, and you will get a folder called V2 Smart Car Lesson 6A. Open the Arduino IDE. Click Sketch, click Include Library, click Add, Zip Library, then load Wi-Fi ESP master.zip file into Arduino. Connect Arduino Uno to PC with USB cable, open Arduino IDE, click File, Click Open, and then choose code V2 Smart Car Lesson 6A.ino in V2 Smart Car Lesson 6A folder. Load the code into Arduino. Replace the 104th line of the code your underscore router underscore SSID with your router Wi-Fi SSID. Replace the 105th line of the code your underscore router underscore Wi-Fi underscore password with Wi-Fi password. Choose Arduino slash Henuino Uno as board, and choose your own port, and then upload the sketch to your board. Click Serial Monitor window in upper right corner of Arduino IDE and you will see connected to your router Wi-Fi SSID and the IP address of your car. Turn on the car and connect your phone with the same router Wi-Fi SSID you use in the code. Open the app, click Settings and enter the IP address of your car in the port 8888, and then click Connect. Click Direction Keys to control robot car by manual and click Middle Key to stop movement. Click Tracking Key to control robot car by moving along black track. Click Obstacle Key to control robot car by moving avoidance obstacle. Mode B, AP Mode 
Download sample code from lesson 6 and then unzip this file, and you will get a folder called V2 Smart Car Lesson 6 B. Connect Arduino Uno to PC with USB cable, open Arduino IDE, click File, click Open, and then choose code V2 Smart Car Lesson 6B.Tino in V2 Smart Car Lesson 6B folder, load the code into Arduino. Check whether you have loaded Wi-Fi ESP Master Library. If not, please follow mode A to loaded Wi-Fi ESP Master Library at first. Choose Arduino slash Henuino Uno as board, and choose your own port, and then upload the sketch to your board. Click settings of your phone, then click veil on setting, then choose OSIO robot as Wi-Fi network. Open the orange icon app, click settings, then enter 192.168.4.1 as IP address and port 8888, then click connect. When you will see connected to OSIO robot in the app, you can control your car. Click direction keys to control robot car by manual and click middle key to stop movement. Click tracking key to control robot car by moving along black track. Click obstacle key to control robot car by moving avoidance obstacle, 